that moment, that opportunity to shift from success to significance, um, to focus on something to help nudge the world with random acts of flowers, um, really did lead to you know what has eventually turned into public service. It started as a, a small idea. Um, it continued to grow. How do you take trash and turn it into a smile? I mean, it's really simple at the end of its day. It's complicated in how we put it together. But the core reaction is the same. How do you take something that's beautiful and, and cherished by everyone and, and then make a meaningful impact? I, I don't know if that's any different than anything you're doing in your business today. It's just a different vessel. It's a different way. But every customer, every person you talk to, um, every interaction you have, every employee you engage, uh, every mentorship that you provide um, has a lasting effect. And really, this is this is my guiding light at this point. You know, this is my. Uh, I, I have this written on the top of my commission book. Every time I sit down for a meeting, every time I sit down, and and we all know this uh, this uh, this you know really powerful opportunity to to say you know here we are and look at we're all doing pretty well. What are we going to do to to help somebody else? And what is what required of us to make this world a little bit better place. Um, I love Knox County. I absolutely love public service. I, I still love about 85% of it. I'll say that. There's about 15% of the muck of politics that um, is, is just hard and, and, you know, it is what it is and we won't get into that. But when um, in 2015 or so, I had a few people ask me would I ever run for office and I said the same thing that you guys all are thinking. Ah, who would, no way, who would want to do that? Um, but I love my community and, and there was a void in leadership and I, I saw a few other people go through it and I realized how much more important um, your elected officials are on a local level. Everyone's going to scream and yell at the national election and the TVs and all the data, you know, daily news. Very few people are going to engage right here on a local level but this is where it impacts your life and this is where it's most important. And so I love being a commissioner. I, I went from never being involved with politics to running countywide, which I don't recommend. It was quite daunting. But in 2018, I pulled out my grandpa's truck and, and went around the county, talked to people and said, all I offer you is rational, thoughtful leadership. I'm not going to promise you anything. I don't know most of what uh, I'm going to be doing, but I'm going to show up every day and work hard. And, and, and people said, okay, give it a shot. I got reelected in 2022 and continue to serve to this day um, and, and love waking up saying, how can I be helpful? What is the opportunity I can do to solve a problem, to answer a question, just be a, a, a navigator for a lot of people. Mm -hmm.